Our church has been running this bazaar for many, many, many years. Back in the um, 50s, I believe it was, the uh, Woman's Guild of our church uh, decided to have a Christmas bazaar, and we have been doing it ever since. They decided many years ago also that it needed a catchy name. So my mother su suggested to the group, let's call it the Jingle Bell Bazaar. So we've been doing that ever since. It's a lot of fun. I have been working in, at this bazaar for many years. Uh, we have people, repeat people. I spoke with a girl from Wilbraham. She said she's never missed our bazaar in 25 or 30 years. So the Jingle Bell Bazaar is an annual event. It's been happening since at least I can remember being a little girl. Um, and it's just, it's a wonderful community event. All of the women of the church and pretty much the whole church actually pitch in and help out. We've got crafts, a bake sale, the cookie walk is probably our most famous thing. Um, they give you a corsage box and you stuff it to the gills with cookies that are handmade by all the ladies. We've actually been up here a bunch of different days uh, creating all different kinds of recipes. Um, and then, you know, we just let everybody go through. I don't think anybody leaves that room without a smile. <laughs> um, and oftentimes people will tell us a story about, you know, a favorite cookie that they find there that they can't find anywhere else. You know, a lady was just telling us about the gingerbread men and how she used to make them with her grandmother. Um, and it's just, it's really sweet and it's great to have people come out. We've got the craft table. We have uh, Brenda Knight's famous pot holder and bowl holders. We sell out of those every year. We literally can't keep them in there no matter how many she makes. Um, we've got greens and this year we have a special table. Uh, Alice Stewart passed away and she was a wonderful woman of our church and I think she actually gave the land the library is on and she left behind so many uh, crafting items and things because she used to do things for us and she used to run our greens table that we put out a table full of free items for people who wanted to craft in her memory and just be able to bring a smile to somebody else's face. So you know the Jingle Bell Bazaar is just good, good people and good fun. Thank you.